Moving right along, that damn it. A jail medical assistant, a MA, is what they say. They ran off on the plug. <laughs> a jail medical assistant has, has ran after admitting that she smoked reefers before she came to work. You would think to yourself, what you mean she ran because she just said, I smoked a little bit before I came to clock in. It's always more to a story. The 912 Garden City checking in. Yeah, here you go. Medical assistant accused of trying to smuggle drugs into the Fulton County Jail is on the run tonight. Takara Ford faces felony drug charges. Fulton County Sheriff Pat Labatt credits a jail captain with hmm. stopping Ford's plan. Fox has Deidre Dukes is live at the jail with the latest on the search for the suspect. Deidre? Well, anyone entering the Fulton County Jail, that means that whether you're a visitor or whether you work here, you must pass through security. But this medical assistant, we are told by the Fulton County Sheriff, ran into trouble as she arrived to work yeah. because an employee noted that she smelled like marijuana and they said when they asked her about it, she admitted that she had smoked pot before she arrived to work. When your colleagues tell on you before you even clock in, <laughs> Them is not your friends. I'm trying to take the cap. When she got to the security checkpoint, she was acting a little nervous. Fulton County Sheriff Pat Labonte credits a captain at the jail for catching Takara Ford in the act. After the contract nurse reportedly showed up to work smelling like marijuana. She smelled a, a hint of, of marijuana and she asked and actually the young lady then said that she had smoked prior to coming to work which is against all rules and regulations. She told a correctional facility. No, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. A correctional facility. Yeah, I blowed a little bit before I came in. This baby ain't have enough education to spray herself with some perfume or something like that, or smoke outside the car, smoke outside the house, or smoke before you leave the goddamn house, or smoke before you take a bath to come to work. Ain't nobody had done told that right now. Ain't nobody had to tell her to put a plastic bag in or a bunny over your head before you blow. Before you go to work. Take a bath before you leave your house after you done smoke. You smoke, bathe, get dressed, then go to work. I can't, I can't. Whoo, boy, people lack, 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 lack the educational information that they need out here in the United screen. Shout out to Mario for the $5 super chat. He said they're trying to pass off Nesquik milk. <laughs> Nesquik milk is baby formula. Listen, powder milk is powder milk, ain't it? But, go, go, go. Search her bag as normal. And they searched the bag as normal. Fulton County Jail. Shout out to Tim for the two dollar cash. Shout. Say shit. My baby food at four months. It is the fuck. I'm trying. It's, it's something like that. Grabbed her keys and ran and walked through the, the parking lot. Jumped in her car and left. Ford fled in a black. That baby grabbed her purse and her keys and ran back to her car. Jumped in it and left. On Altima, Tennessee tag seven five A R four four. These are images of the illegal contraband mm. deputies say they found in Ford's bag. 6.8 ounces of marijuana, 20 grams of crack cocaine, 200 cigarettes. That baby came in with 200 squares. Do you know? Her? Listen, 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 listen. Listen. It is 20 cigarettes in the pack. If you get the cartons, it's 10, it's 10 cartons. I'm um, 10. 10 packs in a card, 20 in each um, 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 pack, that 200. If math right, 20 times 10 is 200. She done opened up all the packs of squares except two, put them in, put them in plastic baggies, and she just thought she was gonna walk in there. I want y'all to understand, this is an educated medical assistance assistance everybody can't be a rn you know what i'm saying say two cigarette two cigarettes in jail is is 25 dollars got to be more careful shout out to bbj for the two dollar super chat say she should have sprayed the hater aid i'm trying to tell you they don't told on your sister and two packs of tobacco sure. oh whoa 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 so she emptied out the whole card in the plastic bag 
those two packs is tobacco for people who like to roll their own. Ooh, they smoking raw in. It's a tobacco. Sheriff Labatt says investigators reviewed a recorded phone call between the suspect and other individuals in which it appears she discussed how she would smuggle the drugs. The sheriff says she had worked at the jail for a few months and that all contract employees are screened. Them players are now cut all up. You know what I'm saying? They looking fine to her and shit. They selling that baby a dream. Baby, I know that you a medical assistant. Baby, I can help you be a RN. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She ain't never seen that many men gawk over her. Gawk. Big word. I ain't even got no screen. Look at her. Try to holler at her. Done, done felt on her something. Ain't nobody tell that baby that all, all phone calls is recorded, sugar. No, no, ain't nobody had them. Baby, they sought you up, baby. <laughs> you ain't even know. Oh, how old is baby? Jeez. We screened all of our contract employees. This just happened to be a, a situation, unfortunately, where I believe the young lady has been influenced by some intern. You say believe, he believed that this young lady has been influenced. I'm so sick of y'all letting these bitch slide with the decisions that they making. Because if we're going to treat them like children, they should not have their degrees, right? Because children aren't old enough to have degrees, right? Situation, unfortunately, where I believe the young lady has been influenced by some internal uh, contact. And for us, it is certainly unfortunate to lose a, a good nurse, but it is time that she turn herself in. It's unfortunately we get to lose a good nurse. Listen, y'all gonna stop talking. Y'all gonna stop calling them nurses, but you can call yourself a nurse. You know what I'm saying? You can, you can do you. you. You can be anything that you want to be. Here, we let men call themselves women, so we let women call themselves men. So, hey, 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 you can, you can be a nurse. You can be a nurse without going through the whole syllabus and shit. You know what I'm saying? Without doing all your prereqs and shit. You, you know, microbiology and shit like that, anatomy. You, you can. Don't even worry about it. We'll hire you. And Ford faces several felony charges tonight, including possession with intent to distribute. Reporting live at the Fulton baby. County Jail, Deidre Dukes, Fox 5 They're going to find your ass uh, in the A, hey, baby. That, damn it, they already got young thug. Them, baby. I'm trying to tell you now. Be careful. Be careful. You say, she ain't no nurse. Uh-uh. Nope, 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 nope. That's what the sergeant or the captain or whoever that was in, in the heavily creased military shirt or the, the sergeant or something he called her a nurse we're gonna let that baby be a nurse out here in these creek and any any of you other medical assistants that is tired of that term because hell maybe the term medical assistance is racist or something mm -mm. Mm. i have no idea <laughs> mm. But hey, hey man, you can be all you can be. Don't let nobody fool you. Hold up now, see, because I had one here and I know I had one. There it is. Ooh, ooh, I'm finna come with some fire. Watch this, watch this. Hold up, hold, hold up, swole up. I just gotta put it on over here because it act like it don't want to be over here. You gotta ask yourself now, 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 people is gonna say that that baby was co coerced. Word. I ain't even got no screen. You know what I'm saying? That, that, that's what folk gonna say. That she didn't have her own mind and she was talked into some flash. Yeah. Sometimes you can be talked into stuff, but I thought that we was adults. To where even if we do get talked into stuff, we still held liable for the things that we got talked into. If we go on a bank rob, um, if we go to do a bank job. And I hire a driver. I need a driver. You know what I'm saying? And or two, three people to help me with this here job that we got to do. And we get caught. You do know they're going to charge all of us with the bank robbery. Even though I may talk some people into it because that's what co coercion is. You talk someone into doing something, but they never really kind of finished the sentence. You talk someone into doing something that they wanted to do or that they did not mind doing but everybody get charged i just really want y'all to really understand how this thing got here in these streets work moving right along